I just got back from the beauty supply store. I always have beauty supply store videos because I just love going to the beauty supply store. Like at least at this point, I just need to open up my own beauty supply store and shut my own store because it's crazy the amount of money I have spent. Okay, but look, guys. So I'm gonna show you yeah, right here. So as you can see, I have nothing but hair products here because I just showed y'all. Like seriously, I have bought everything in the last past couple of days because i don't know why but i have been wanting to start doing hair so bad lately and if you know me you guys every time i always obviously love doing makeup so i've been a makeup artist for a couple of years now and everybody would always tell me like why don't you start doing hair like or do you like doing hair and i would always brush it off and be like no like hair is just not for me because it's never been for me like i don't even like doing my own hair like you know but i don't know why i got this like motivation to want to start doing hair on like others you know what i mean like start doing like peinados i did take a hair class when i was like 19 that my mom paid for or that she wanted me that she actually paid for um because whenever i was starting to do makeup she wanted me to do hair and makeup and so she invested into paying for my hair class that i took with a hairstylist that does amazing work and i think she still does work does hair to this day but honestly you guys i took the class and i never did anything with them but i did learn a little bit and i do still have some videos that i took from the class find this program from online i think it's like called rachel's academy hairstylist or whatever and she basically shows you step by step how to do a hairstyle whether it's hollywood waves updos ponytails she also tells you how to disinfect your products tells you what products that she likes best that she what she uses the products for like everything like every detail and so you know me like i once i get my head into something i go out and do the whole shebang okay so i ended up going to the beauty supply store i ended up going to ulta and i also ended up going to sally's because i needed to buy the products i need to work with um uh, because i do have a um hair appointment and a makeup appointment this week this weekend so i obviously needed to buy the hair tools and the hair products that i need for this weekend's client the so yeah guys and these are used for like whenever you do like hollywood waves and stuff like that then i did end up buying some creaseless hair clips these are huge you guys like these are big and these are used to like whenever you do like a wave on top of the hair like you know like whenever you want it like more volume on the side you clip them away you spray them down and you let them cool down some hair pins bobby pins i got them in gold and in black i actually need some on amazon that i want to buy which are the matte ones because you know the shiny ones are kind of harder to not show on the hair so i'm gonna buy some brown blonde and black ones just to stock up on just you know because you you need a lot a lot of bobby pins you guys whenever you do like updos and stuff um because this is what secures the hair so i bought bobby pins and then I also ended up buying a couple of brushes. I have more brushes over there, but I don't feel like going to the room. So I got a natural brush. This is like to make the hair super soft or whatever. So this is a natural bore bristle brush. Like I said, I signed up for that program. So she basically had like everything linked already that you need to buy. So it was pretty easy for me to go like find it. But I just went to my local beauty supply store and bought it in store because i didn't want to wait because i'm so impatient but yeah so this kind of hairbrush i guess is to like smooth down your hair and it doesn't hurt you know it just smooths everything down like you see beautiful oh my god i'm excited to be a hairstylist now fuck what me I'm but this brush came with this one and this one was $3.99 i do want to invest in some hair tools that she that she showed uh but for now i'm just gonna go ahead and use these because obviously like the hair tools i just see it as like like my makeup brushes some makeup brushes that are more expensive work good you know and they do the job faster and easier so that's just how it is for hair too so this one is the deluxe pintail comb so i've seen that she uses this one to like tease the hair and then i bought this one i don't know for i don't know and then i also bought a detangler brush so those brushes were 2.99 um and this one was 3.99 i needed a detangler brush that's gonna be for like to keep in my client's kit for my clients for the hair so i bought this one I also ended up purchasing these buns these hair buns 
because obviously these are for like to do any hairstyle you can easily like also cut them and shape them however you want to so i just bought different sizes for now these ones this one was five dollars this one was four dollars and then the little one was two dollars so just depending on the size i guess it goes price range differently the bigger the size obviously the more expensive so i seen some on shein you guys that i want to buy so i'm going to purchase them on shein but for now these will do so these are the ones that i'm going to do and i will be posting a hair video soon of me doing a hair updo using those so i'm so excited for clips so like you know whenever i'm like putting the hair away and then i also purchased these these are just like hairpins to apply on the hair whenever you do a hairstyle like if they want to apply some to accessorize their hair i got some for them um and then i also bought this one for this this weekend's client just to see if she wants to put it on the side of her hair or wherever it's going to land at but yeah these are two dollars each and then this one was eight dollars i found some prettier ones that i've seen on amazon and on shein so i will be purchasing some on there now let's get into the good stuff which is the hair products that i bought went to the beauty supply store and i bought this hair product i used to use this like years years ago you guys when i was little this is the i don't know how to say that rooks rooks i don't know but you see the brand this is 8.99 this was 8.99 let me take this off this smells so so good you guys and i didn't buy this for like my clients or anything i bought this specifically for me and my daughter because it's a rejuvenating keratin and repair and shine leave-in treatment for damaged hair um so this is works well for straightening your hair detangles and conditions increases moisture tames frizz and shines with argan oil so i like this um i like this because it works really really good for detangling your hair and also protecting your hair it works really really good and it smells amazing you guys oh, i love the way this smells so yeah it just smells so good um i like to use this for my daughter because her hair gets really tangled like her hair is pinned straight but it gets tangled so easily especially because she has like fine thin hair so it gets tangled really easily so i bought that for her and then so i seen that she also the the girl that i purchased the academy from she's she put the products that she uses best and i also been doing a lot of research and seeing a bunch of hairstylists on what they recommend and what products they don't recommend and what they use and what they don't use so i seen that this is like a favor from like most hairstylists if not everybody this is the red can spray wax so it's a fine wax mist for textured looks so i seen that they use this for like any hairstyle so i bought this one and i believe this was 25 dollars then i purchased the chi iron the chi thermal protecting spray so this is just a spray to um to protect your hair from heat so before you apply before you straighten your hair or you curl your hair or you do any hairstyling in your hair with hair tools with hot tools you want to have a heat protectant to protect your hair from the heat so it doesn't damage it and i believe this one was also 20 something dollars i believe close to 20 dollars and then i bought the chi helmet head this is the small version one because i wanted to see how it works this one was ten dollars and it's the extra firm hairspray so it's just a hairspray and it's the level five so this hairspray you use it like whenever you're done and you want to lock in your hairstyle you just spray this over so it can like capture that and stay in place then from ulta i also went and bought the sexy hair powder so this is a texturizing powder and you just apply this for volumizing and texturizing your hair so if you want your hair to be like you know how you have those hair big updos for quinceañeras or whenever they want just those big hollywood curls and they have a lot of volume to it you apply some of this or if you hair if you feel like your hair um needs more volume you just apply a little bit of this on your roots you like you know move it around and it gives you so much volume you guys and this one was 20 something dollars but i highly recommend it because it works really really good i went to the beauty supply store a couple of like a week ago and i ended up buying this one this is the barber powder wax this is for hair styling so again it's just like another powder wax i don't really like this one because it's very very sticky and i don't feel like it lasts long so when i heard about this one i tried it out and i loved it so i bought the big full-size bottle 
So if anything, once this runs out, I just put it in here and still use this. But I like this more for like men's hair. Like say if you have a boy or a son or your husband or your boyfriend, you know, he wants to like texturize his hair. This is really good. And I bought this for like $11. So I didn't know what shine mist or anything to use for like to make your hair shiny. So I asked the girl from Sally's and she recommended me this. But honestly, I don't like it. This is not what I was looking for. But I'm still going to keep it because I'm still going to use it for my daughter. Because it's a detangling shine mist. So it detangles your hair but it also makes it shiny. Because it protects while adding shine and increases softness. But that's not what I wanted for. I, I wanted something like this. So this is the Olive Oil Nor Nourishing Sheen Spray. So this sheen spray, basically, whenever you're done with your hairstyle, if you want, if you feel like the hairspray made the hair look a little bit too dry or if they have dry hair, if you have dry hair, you spray a little bit of this sheen spray over your hair and it makes it shiny. So I bought this product and this one was $4. I wanted to use a little bottle because I want to see how it works before I go buy another sheen spray. If I don't like this one, I can just buy another one. So this is the extreme hold in number five. I use, I see that a lot of hairstylists use this one also for hairspray. This one was seventeen dollars. Um, I think at the beauty supply was the cheapest place I've seen it at because Ulta has it for like almost twenty, and then Sally's had it for like twenty something dollars, like twenty four dollars. And so when I seen it there and it was seventeen dollars, I was like, might as well pick it up. Um, it was just a couple of bucks cheaper than everywhere else so yeah i seen this one that's basically it for my hair products um that i bought for my hairstylist journey so like i said i do want to become a hairstylist i am gonna go back to cosmetic school because if y'all don't know i did went to palm mitchell cosmetology school about four or five years ago right after i had my daughter um maybe in like 2019 um, but I ended up not graduating because I, I didn't have the passion for it and I feel like it was my thing but now I'm like kind of motivated to go back to school so I'm excited to like try out all these products you guys like I'm so excited I'm excited to start my hair journey also right now like if you know me I love 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 glitter like I love glitter I love glitter on hair I love glitter on body I love glitter on my face I'm just and love with glitter so if you don't have this i highly recommend you to buy this 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 is the eva nyc silver glitter hairspray guys this is a hair and body spray so you can like put this on your body i see a lot of people doing it i do it myself too but look look at look, look at the spray look at that look at that glitter like bro this is so pretty i applied it on my daughter's hair for when i did her hair for picture day it's so pretty so yeah i think that one was like $15 or $10. I bought it at Ulta, but that's about it. Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and I'll be updating y'all soon on how my hair journey goes. And if not, I'll also be uploading a hair video very soon. So stay on the lookout for that. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you for watching. I love you. Bye.